Classmates, friends, and teammates all gathered Monday night to remember Jasper Jazz Howard. He was the University of Connecticut starting cornerback who was killed on the store's campus Saturday night. Howard and another teammate were stabbed during a fight outside a school-sponsored dance. Brian Parker sustained only minor injuries. He's expected to recover. Now an arrest appears imminent in the case. A Connecticut attorney says his client will be arrested in connection with Howard's death. Darren Freeman would not identify his client and said his client did not stab Howard, but was present when Howard was mortally wounded. The whole reason why he came up here was to get away from the violence, and violence is what, you know, killed him, and it's just sad. It's something you can't get over and it's I'm sore in the back of almost every student's mind. Monday evening Howard's family arrived in Connecticut from Miami. They were greeted at the airport by the head football coach Randy Edsel. And the idea of him coming all the way up to Connecticut where his mother thought he was safe. That he would grow up into a better man and come back and support his family like he was planning on doing. Is heart broken? Edsel confirmed Monday that Howard was about to become a father. Connecticut is scheduled to play West Virginia Saturday. The team will wear a sticker with Howard's initials on its helmet for the rest of the season and carry either Howard's helmet or jersey to away games. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.